Welcome back to a new video from Visual Art Classroom at the uh, Isaac Albanese Secondary School. We have a chair, uh, and this is ex an example of about how to work, how to draw a chair in uh, a linear perspective drawing. So uh, the first thing we have to do is to draw the profile of the furniture we're going to deal with. Uh, next is to to join the main points of the of the chair in, in in this case to the vanishing point you are looking here so I'm, I'm going first to work just the back and the seat so you, you um, and, and, and I'm going to set aside just for a while the uh, the legs so um, one important idea uh, you need to keep in mind is that you are going to uh, decide uh, how long is going to be your chair in depth so you, you can choose uh, any point any depth uh, you prefer but for example um, you can choose this point so if you choose this point uh, as your uh, the, the length for your uh, back the only thing you have to do is, is, is draw a line that is going to be parallel to this one so and, and the width of the line is just the, uh, the, the the distance that is marked by these two lines, the lines that are convergent to the vanishing point. Once you have started the only thing you, you have to do is to follow the same way so I'm, I, I draw a line that is parallel to this line in the back uh, and the, the, the limit for this line is just the projecting line to the that is going to the vanishing point in the back I keep going the same way for the rest of the seat and I have so you you can see I have already drawn mm, the back and the seat of my chair so I'm going to uh, let me work for a while yes in order to change a little the lines so that they can just keep the Yes, let me get closer. I'm going to open these two sort of lines. <laughs> Sorry. Sometimes it's a little bit tricky. So I already have melded the back and the seat of my chair. So I'm almost done, but I need to keep going with the two legs of the chair. So since the, the the legs are just in the beginning of the profile of the uh, chair, I, I'm, I'm going to, to, to do the same, just uh, working from these two points and joining them to the vanishing point. I'm going to do the same from these two points and of course from the two legs in the lowest part it's always to join the, the main points to the uh, different so I'm, I, I'm going to start working with a vertical line is vertical so from this point I'm going to draw a line parallel you see to this line and the next one is going to be horizontal and the next one is going to be parallel as well but the important thing here is that you don't need to work the whole thing because for example this one was only for the sake of just placing the leg of the chair so I already have these two lines drawn, it is very important. You can 
give it a color and we are going to do the same the same thing uh, with this the chair this this leg sorry so I'm I'm going to start working from this point because this is the, the final point so sorry <laughs> this is yes line that is horizontal from this point why this point because you can see that this point corresponds to this point this is the one that I'm looking for so I start from this point and I draw here a line that is going to be parallel to the leg the same way here and of course here so I'm, I'm going to, to erase this one I don't need it any longer I'm going to adjust these two points and I'm going to give it another color yeah so I'm going to finish just deleting the lines I don't need any longer yes these ones so you can see let me I'm going to well I, 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 I can leave this one this way so let's see from some distance the result for our uh, drawing so we have the chair perfectly done in linear perspective I hope this video is going to help you un better understand uh, how to work with uh, furniture in general so, uh, so long, boys. I'll see you soon uh, in a new video in the future.